Hello and welcome to my channel, Luna the Moon Tarot. First of all, thank you so much everyone for tuning in. Today's uh, reading will be, are they watching you or are they stalking you? So basically, I will be going through uh, all the zodiac signs here, you know, uh, the air, water, fire and earth. So let's see what is it that you should know, whether they are stalking slash watching you or not, right? So I will be also mentioning the timestamps at the bottom of the, uh, at, uh, at the description below. So you can, uh, you need not to watch the entire video and you can directly move on to your zodiac sign. Right, uh, so let's start without wasting much of uh, your time. So I'll be starting with the air signs. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I'll be taking out three cards. Right. And then I will be reading it out to you that this particular spread is for my dear Gemini's here. Let's see. This is for the air sign. Uh, I'll start with the air signs first. Gemini, Libra and Aquarius. Right. So let's see. Is your person stalking you or watching you online or otherwise is your person stalking you or watching you online or otherwise all right so we have nine of cups we have knight of pentacles we have four of swords here and the bottom of the deck dear a signs gemini libra aquarius I see nine of pentacles here. I somehow feel, uh, I somehow feel, dear air signs, that in recent past, you know, your person thought that you are the one and wanted to have a life with you. They they thought that you are somebody they can have family with. They thought that you are somebody who is, uh, you know, very logical, very practical when it comes to decision making. And, uh, uh, you know, probably they can have a family with you. So they wanted a long term commitment. That is the recent past. Probably few of you, I feel that uh, that is also one thing that pushed you back. Right. That pushed you back. Probably they were trying to be a little too clingy or they were uh, too soon. They were asking for a commitment in current energy uh, and in future and in the current energies and in the future energies. I see that. I see that, that they have taken a break from social media. Probably your person has either blocked you. Uh, on social media or they have uh, you know totally deleted their own account so if you see the four of swords here it means that there is a social media detox that they are taking right now they are taking a rest from this situation from the situation that has been created between you and them. So I feel either they have taken a social media uh, off, you know, a detox from social media or they have blocked you, right? Because they want to, they just want to be alone right now. They just want to take rest from this particular situation and they just want to be away from it. I see nine of pentacles here. Somehow I feel that, you know, your person is kind of walking away from you. Yeah. Your person is kind of walking away from you and, uh, you know, they, they, they want to balance their emotional uh, side and they want to... 
uh, gain that uh, that uh, that kind of emotional balance back in their life hence they are walking away from you so it's it's a kind of uh, you know uh, it's a kind of a detachment thing that i see right now in most of your energies dear gemini libra aquarius dear a signs i see that they uh, you know they felt tied down to you in recent past they felt tied down to you they felt that you know as if they are tied to you and they are bound to take care of you things became a little claustrophobic they that you know they couldn't breathe and emotionally they got overwhelmed they became overwhelmed hence i believe this entire situation was created that's why this entire situation took place at the first place right i see nine of cups i see they have blocked you or they are off from social media i see them walking away and i also see that emotionally they feel free now they feel free now emotionally right so they are not stalking you they have rather blocked you they are they have taken a break they have taken a break from social media but they are not block, uh, they are not stalking you they are not watching you right now right so that's about my air signs moving on to my water signs here i'm just writing down the timestamp here okay water signs this is for cancer scorpio pisces let's see what is it that you should know is your person that you have in mind right now are they stalking you or are they watching you this is for my water signs are they watching you are they stalking you this is for my water signs cancer scorpio pisces are they watching you three cards this is for cancer scorpio pisces this is for cancer scorpio pisces please are they watching you or are they stalking you Ace of Cups. Let's see what the other cards say. Give me two more cards. This is the Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Are they watching you or are they stalking you? Cancer Scorpio Pisces, please. Are they watching you? Cancer Scorpio Pisces, are they watching you? One more card, please. All right, bottom of the deck is three of pentacles here and ace of pentacles here. I think in recent past, uh, there's a lot of pentacle cards that I see at the bottom of the deck, deck six of pentacles too. I see in recent past, uh, dear Scorpions, uh, your person uh, was looking for a commitment. There was a new beginning that started with a commitment. You know, the kind of... Uh, 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 the kind of energy that I see, it was a give and take uh, energy, a more grounded energy. And I think you are dealing with an earth sign here. 
right uh virgo taurus or capricorn and there was a new beginning that happened and that was more grounded one wherein you know you guys uh, connected and probably you or them were looking for a commitment and you both were working on this particular relationship or on this connection but i see that in current and in uh, future energies i see that there is an emotional offer that has been given to you again you may be even dealing with a water sign cancer scorpio or pisces but uh, in current energy i see that uh, you are being offered a cup of love through them right i see page of swords as well just be careful i somehow feel that uh, there is somebody who is kind of viewing or watching your social media for sure and they are kind of keeping a tap on you probably a common friend that's what i feel a common friend is keeping a tap on you and probably they are giving a you know miscommunication or probably they are giving false information sorry to your person that can be a possibility that uh, maybe not them but then uh, if not their friend then it is their energy they are uh, kind of uh, watching you on social media and they are trying to find out more things about you right also i see three of swords uh, i see that in the coming uh, few days uh, i feel that there is some kind of bad news that is going to come through your person because i see that they are totally emotional for you excuse me i'm so sorry that was a loud sneeze really sorry apologies for that so none of my reading goes without coughing or sneezing <laughs> sorry so i do see in current and future energies um that there is an emotional offer that is being offered towards you however i do see that there is also a bad news coming in and there is a lot of uh, yes there is i feel uh, either a friend a common friend of you yours who is giving a miss uh, who is giving uh, false information to your person and probably because of that you guys are also getting into a fight you know that misunderstanding or confusion is getting created between you and your person here so be careful uh, just try and figure it out whatever it is just try and resolve it do not get into any kind of arguments here if it's not a common uh, common friend then they are the one who's watching you right now on social media and they might see something that uh, miss uh, that may create a, a spark a friction uh, not a spark but a friction between you both and because of which you might you know uh, or uh, you both might uh get this heartbreak right so this is for my water sign here let's see what do we have for my fire signs and let me quickly write down the time stamps here as well aries leo and saji let's see what is it that we have for my aries leo and saji are they stalking you are they watching you this is for my Aries, Leo, and Saji. Are they watching you? This is for my Aries, Leo, and Saji. Are they stalking you? The person on your mind. Are they stalking you? This is for my Aries, Leo, Saji. This is for my fire signs. Are they stalking you? this is for my fire signs here give me three cards are they stalking you nine of wands two of wands okay a lot of fire energy fire signs it is leo saji i think you are dealing with the fire signs it's uh, you know fire signs again here probably aries aries leo saji you are dealing with aries leo saji you know probably uh you are in touch probably the person that you are uh, in uh, you know probably the person that you are connected with have aries leo saji as well in their chart so at the bottom of the deck i see knight of wands eight of cups and two of swords here 
so i somehow feel uh dear fire signs aries leo and saji in recent past i see that somebody is walking away from you you know whatever offer that you had over here it is lying right here but then that person is just walking away from that offer you know you had something to offer them i feel but then they are they walked away from it however i see knight of wands as well i see there is some kind of fast communication uh i see that there is some kind of communication that uh they want to go ahead and do and that is some passionate communication that they are thinking about but then you know they don't know whether they should or they should not i feel that they are stuck somewhere in their mind whether they should approach you or they should not approach you but i definitely see that somebody is walking away here right i definitely see that that your person has walked away from you then uh in current and in future energies i see nine of wands i see a stuck energy over here i see that uh you know you uh, uh your person is feeling stuck your person is definitely feeling stuck they if they want they can come out of this stuck situation wherein they don't know whether to contact you or whether not to contact you they are kind of contemplating they are just kind of juggling within themselves whether they should go ahead and contact you they should not go ahead and contact you but then i feel that they are in a stuck energy right now wherein they don't know whether to contact you or not however if required they can definitely come out of this particular energy right but they are kind of they are willing to but also at the same point of time they are guarded if you just see that this lady is standing with a wand in her hand so they she's kind of probably they have gone through a past they have had a difficult past a bad past because of which they are guarded even if they want to communicate with you they are not communicating with you because they are kind of guarded they have kept their walls up high they are afraid of getting hurt then i see two of wands here i somehow feel that again it's a contemplation mode whether to contact you whether not to contact you right here and i somehow feel that yes they are also watching you from afar they are not making too much of efforts they are not stalking you but they are watching you in a way right also uh, i see that this person has a lot of passion towards you a lot of passion towards you they are looking at their world they are reflecting right now and they are thinking about their past then they are thinking how will you, are you also the same the kind of people that they have met in their past are you also like them are you not like them it's like contemplation mode there's a lot of confusion uh which is hap uh, which is which is involved here a lot of confusion if you just see at this girl there is a globe right uh, kept right in front of her and there's a bus also probably uh you are going to travel pretty soon or probably your person is going to travel pretty soon because um i see that uh, you know this bus is this bus is telling me that probably there is some kind of mode of communication they will be taking to travel you know just a travel thing that i see and then there's a globe now this globe can be a trap you know that person wants to travel or wherever you are located probably you have a long distance relationship or whatsoever then i see that you know uh i see the star i i feel that you know you want this person to come forward you want to get in touch with this person you want to speak to them again but then since you are in a mode wherein you have kept your walls up high you're guarded and you're just contemplating and not taking any step you're just reflecting resurrecting right now you know uh looking at your own world your past whatever has happened and try contemplating whether i should whether i should not but then i see a wish fulfillment coming pretty soon in your life so i somehow feel probably you guys want to get in touch with them but then you are scared of getting in touch with them probably as a fear of rejection as well 
but then i see a wish fulfillment coming soon and i think you guys are going to reunite again here right and that could happen at uh, venus retrograde so 19th is when the venus uh, will start retrogating and guys also tomorrow is a full moon uh, do check out my instagram pay page uh, or you know the stories how you should what are the full moon rituals what you should do and um, you know just uh, just write down journal and whatever don't serve you anymore just write it down burn it off or probably you can burn a bay leaf as well and just start afresh on a new moon cycle now moving on to the earth sign taurus virgo capricorn let me quickly write down the time stamps here hope you all are doing good dear taurus virgo capricorn let's see uh, whether your person are they watching you or are they stalking you is your person watching you or stalking you here is your person watching you or stalking you this is for my earth sign taurus virgo capricorn please tell me are the person on their mind are they watching them stalking them person on their mind are they watching them or stalking them the person on their mind are they watching them or stalking them all right this is for my earth sign are they watching them or stalking them taurus virgo capricorn this is for my taurus virgo capricorn all right the first card that came is a heartbreak card all right three of swords page of cups and queen of pentacles bottom of the deck is knight of pentacles again i see in recent past your person you know they walked away from you and then i see four of cups you know they i i somehow feel that emotionally they uh, are still dwelling on their uh, on their past and whatever uh, bad relationships that they have had they are still looking at them they are not looking sorry they are not looking at uh, they are not looking at the uh, cup of love that is being offered full of love to them but they are looking at the cup which are empty they are looking at dwelling at their in their past i also see in recent past your person is walking away from you probably uh, you were expecting this person to give you a commitment and they did not give you a commitment probably you kind of pushed them hard and because of that uh, there was some kind of friction that got created and they just walked away right and that is why i see in current and future energy there is a heartbreak three of cards that i see here i see that you know uh, they are in a dreamy state of mind they are expecting a reconciliation uh, to happen soon and they are totally uh, imagining those reconciliation they are thinking about what uh, went wrong and uh, they are revisiting all the uh, you know moments that you guys have spent together they are revisiting everything and uh, they 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 uh, you know they see you as somebody who can take control uh, uh, who can manage and take control of this relationship and is a very grounded energy very poised energy very uh, classy sort of energy that i see somebody you would uh, they would like to get married to but then i think right now the time is not right even if they look at you as somebody that they can commit but right now they are not ready to do that and somehow when you ask them for a commitment they feel that they are getting um, you know uh, they are getting they are being pushed for it however they are dreaming about you they are thinking about you a lot 24 7 and they are uh, revisiting all the moments that you guys have spent together i feel that they are not stalking you but definitely they are watching you from afar without harming you or without any kind of ill intentions coming in your way right so that's about it my uh uh dear lovelies so uh anybody anybody uh who's interested for a personal reading 
uh, you can check out you can dm me or you can comment below or you can uh, dm me on my instagram the link is in the description box below i am open for uh, a reading for you guys and uh, thank you so much everyone for tuning into my channel uh, i would really request and appreciate in uh, if you go ahead and share like subscribe and follow me on instagram right do hit the notification bell so that whenever i upload any such video you are able to get the notification also do not try and deliberately fit yourself in this particular reading do check out your sun moon rising and venus sign also remember that the time is fluid if it is not resonating right now it may do in future so good night for now thank you everybody and take care. Bye-bye.